everyone, my name is Matthias. In this video I will teach you how to play nail horn mirrors. Uh, if you would like to follow this lesson with the, with the tab, with the lyrics and the chord symbols, you can download the PDF file from my Patreon page. Let's start with the chords. The first chord what you have to know is an E minor chord. So E open string, 2nd fret on the A string, 2nd fret on the D string and G, B, E open string. The 2nd chord is G major, 3rd fret on the low E string, 2nd fret on the A string. The D, the G and the B string will be open. The next chord is the A minor chord. A open string, 2nd fret on the D string, 2nd fret on the G string and 2nd fret on the B string. The high E string gonna be open. The last chord for this song gonna be D major. D open string, 2nd fret on the G string, 3rd fret on the B string and 2nd fret on the high E string. Let's talk about the intro. The first note in the intro gonna be the 3rd fret on the low E string and the, and the 4th fret on the G string. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and. This is the first bar. In the second bar um, we have a D note, A string 5th fret and B string 7th fret. 2 and 3 and 4 and and you have to repeat these two bars two times so the intro goes like this 1 and 2 and actually I'm using my thumb and the middle finger to pick those strings so 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and 2 and 3 and 4 and 1 and I will show you closer the, the plucking pattern. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. You can play the same thing without the finger pick. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and... So it doesn't matter that if you have a finger pick or not. Okay, let's play slower one more time the intro. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and... The next part gonna be the verse. In the verse you have to repeat these two bars three times. After you have to play uh, the fifth fret on the low E string and the sixth fret on the G string, two and three and four and, and the seventh fret on the low E string, seventh fret on the G string, one and two and, and the A major chord 5th fret on the low E string, 6th fret on the G string, once more, and 2 and. So the new part in the verse sounds like this. 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and. So now let's play the whole verse all together. 1, 2 and 3 and 4 and 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and 2 and 3 and 4 and 1 and 2 and 3 and new part 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and and you have to repeat this part this whole part once more Okay, let's jump into the next part, which is the pre-chorus. So it sounds like this. So you have to grab the B minor chord after that low E string, G string, A string, G, D, G, A, G. One more time. E, G, A, 
G D G A G after that you have to repeat the same plucking pattern in your in your plucking hand but the chord gonna be D major chord up here E E string G string A string G string D G A G After that you have to play an A major chord it's a bar chord so 5th fret on the A string 7th fret on the A string 7 on the D and 6th on the G sounds like this Okay, let's play the whole pre-chorus all together. Okay, the next part is the chorus. In the first chorus, you just have to play every chord on the first beat. So we learn the chords. The first is gonna be E minor, G major, D major, A major. So once more, E minor, 4, G major, 3, 4, D major, 3, 4, A major, 3, 4. And you have to repeat once more this part. 1, 2, 3, 4, G major, 3, 4, D major, 3, 4, A major, 3, 4. After that, we have to repeat these chords. This part will be still the chorus, but here the strumming pattern comes in. It sounds like this. Down, down, up, up, down, up, 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 down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. And you have to repeat this part once more. Down, down, up, up, down, up, G major, up, down, up, D, up, up, down, up, A major, up, down, up, down, down, up, 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 up, down, up. And you have to repeat it once more. Okay, after the second pre-chorus, after the second part, the strumming part of the pre-chorus, you have to repeat the verse the pre-chorus and the chorus again. After we have a new part which is the bridge and actually the bridge is the same as the chorus so you have to play the same chords E minor, G major, D major, A major and the stream, same strumming pattern in this part so the bridge gonna be exactly the same as the chorus. After we gonna have one more verse, so you have to play the same riff. What we learn. After that, we have one more chorus and the outro. In the outro, we have to play the same chords, but the strumming pattern gonna be different. We only have down strums. It sounds like this. And the original songs fade out with this riff. This was the whole song. We talked about every part. You can easily jump back. The next part will be the play along part. So if you learn this song, let's try to play with me.
I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget that you can download the tab with the lyrics, chord symbols, strumming patterns from my Patreon page. And give it a like if you enjoyed the video, share with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye.